Now that we've downloaded the JVA Cloud Router app and registered our account, we can now put in our credentials and go ahead and log in. As you can now see, what it's done is brought up um, our existing sites, being our factory as well as our farm on the app. We can see that the system is armed and there's no indication of any faults. Our gateway is online and it shows our ZLM4 as well as our JVA Z28 with our feed and return voltages and everything is in a good state. Going back to our overview, let's see how our farm is doing. Our Nimbus gateway is online and our Jumbo is working as it should. We can also pull comprehensive logs of what our various sites have been doing so we can see exactly when the system was armed, disarmed, as well as any faults along the fence. Let's now go to add a new site, which we've just done. So I'd like to add my home onto my JVA app. Once the profile has been created, it comes with the various icons. To add a new device, we push the plus button. You'll now see gateway serial number. That's the serial number of our JVA 3G GSM or 4G GSM, as well as our Nimbus gateway. Put in the serial number over there. And select add. What you'll now see is to auto detect and pick up the relevant devices that is loaded to that gateway. You see we have the JVA Z18 as well as the JVA RF interface and that has been auto assigned to the home site. Let's go back to our overview and now we can see it's been successfully added to the rest of our sites being factory, farm and home. If we go into home we can now see the status of our Wi-Fi gateway being online the supply voltage and signal strength. You can also see our RF interface as well as the relevant zones and then our JVA Z18. If we were to scroll back to the top, give a site arm high, what that now does, it will arm the entire system. And the noise that we're hearing now is the push notification coming from the JVA app. So we can now see it's been armed, as well as which site has been armed, and the device. Visually, we can also see the RF interface, zones 1 to 6. We've got nothing programmed on 7 and 8 as yet. And we can also see the feed and return voltage of our JVA Z18. We can individually turn these on and off. So we can disarm the Z18. And we also get the notification up here at the top to indicate that it's been disarmed via the JVA cloud router. As you can see, our RFI is still um, in the armed condition. And we can also do a full site arm for all of the devices connected to our Wi-Fi gateway. Again, our push notification coming through alerting all the users that are connected to the site, um, whether the system has been armed, disarmed, or whether there's an alarm on the beams or on the electric fence. Nice feature that we can also do is we can rename any of these zones over here, but we also have the option of a digital output and input. And what this allows us to do is to connect a transmitter and receiver to our gate. As well as our garage. And now we have the ability to switch our gate, to open our gate, as well as our garage, making the JVA um, a all-in-one solution for your security systems. So as soon as you arrive home, you log on to your JVA Cloud Router app, you open the gate, and then you can drive through while disarming the relevant beams. So just going through that again.
back into the home setup. Everything will be in the armed condition. And I'll push notification coming through again. All right, now that we've done arming the system, we can then log out and carry on with our day. Should there be any problem within any of our sites, we'll get a push notification to establish that which site it has been and what device has actually been triggered. So through push notification, we get the alert. Now through push notification, you can immediately see that there's an alarm at home on the Z18, a low voltage alarm. If we were to click on that message, it takes us immediately through to the site in question and we can see alarm, fence alarm on zone one. You can now take the necessary precautions as well as having the peace of mind knowing that you have full control as well as monitoring of all your sites through the JVA Cloud Router app.